Let's continue. There's nothing. Nothing at all. I'm going here then. I change every day, uh -huh. so as long as yeah, <clears throat> you have the money for it, you can do it each time you're free. Okay, take place over the next four days. Huh. Oh, it's four? That was five. Morning. Everyone who's in the internship program, please follow me to the back entrance. We'll provide you all with uniforms. Once everybody's dressed, we'll get to work. Follow me, plebs. You don't deserve to go through the front entrance. The customers don't want to look at you. When you're done there, could I ask you to take the trash out? Uh huh. No offense, but I think someone would say, let's just like that. So, thanks, then I go, eh, I'll go, eh, and I'll forget it. Oh, hey. Morning. You uh, look good in that uniform. I forgot you chose this place too. I think I feel less than far because I react to some of the boy here and there. Uh, yeah. So I guess we both picked the same place for the internship program. You're already a step ahead of me, though. I overslept like hell. Uh. Oh, damn it. Oh, I really screwed this one up. Coming in late on my first day, they're gonna be so pissed. I know a guy who works here. He said the manager's a real hard ass. Man, I really don't want to go in now. What do I do? I just noticed there's a picture of knockoff Batman in the window. <laughs> oh shh! Come that way. <laughs> so they have. I'm pretty sure the clips go on the left as well because the image is the um Burger King one. Yep. So we have knockoff Burger King, knockoff Batman, and if you turn the wild duck upside down, knockoff McDonald's. Yeah. Well. You'll come apologize with me? Dude, you're the best, Not man. <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. We're ripping off. I can't just tell them no. I overslept. Wait a minute. I could just pretend I was here all along. Put on a uniform and stroll in like nothing happened. I'll just say my stomach wasn't feeling so good and I was in the bathroom this whole time. Uh huh. Except. So, uh. Please, do me a solid. Grab me one of those uniforms and bring it out here. I'll treat you to any food you want. 
You can look at my homework, so please. Fine. I want to see you here anyway. Real? I owe you my life, man. Just hop on in there and grab it real quick. If you hide it under your shirt, nobody will. Oh, there you are. Working hard. Seriously? Why do I get stuck having to supervise two classes worth of students? I'm suddenly the young and spry teacher when it's convenient. Sorry, I shouldn't be complaining to students. In any case, it looks like you two are doing just... Uh... Hey, Tomochika, why are you still dressed like that? Wait a minute, don't tell me. Well, uh, you see, I may have slightly overslept. Are you kidding me? How many times did I tell you all to be here not a minute late? Jeez. First someone skipping out, and now this? Why does it always have to be my class? What? Somebody skipped out? Well, that's just terrible. Talk about a failure of a human being. So, who was it? Don't you grin at me like you found a friend. More importantly, I sure hope you called to let them know you were going to be late. Uh, well, you see, I guess my schedule just didn't line up, so... Always call first when you're running late. It's common sense. Ugh, I'm definitely getting a talking to later. You're going to go apologize right now. And I am Wait, going to laugh. Now? I, I need to gather my thoughts first and, right. um... And what exactly do you mean by that? that? You're not trying to find some way of getting out of this, are you? Are you even aware of all the trouble you could have caused? You left the team short-staffed. The manager's probably worried. If this were a real job, you'd be fired on the spot. Now, go in there and apologize. Be ready to accept whatever punishment you get. He must yes. make love to the statue. In public. He must pump the mask. No, he must pollute the mascot. Oh. The, slightest, but the mascot's the one in charge. If it makes you this upset, you shouldn't have been late in the first place. Remember, when you apologize, try to explain how you'll improve for next time. It reflects on you better. And no excuses. Make sure you really mean it. You got that? Makes sense. Well, here I go. See you later. Oh, no, you don't. I'm watching this shit. <sighs> Guess I should go put in an apology from my side as well. Oh, by the way, have you heard anything from Iori? Well, if you haven't heard anything, it's fine. But if he's playing hooky, there's gonna be hell to pay. <sighs> he has no idea how much trouble he's causing me. Tell him he'd better at least call out next time. Anyway, I'll be going now. Put on a big smile and show them how much you love working service jobs. So, lie. Got it. Yeah, basically. They're probably so short staffed they didn't have the energy. Bet you at the end of the week he'll get a bollocking. Speaking of which, yep. it's the end of the week. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> they knock off that man. Oh, they have an actual stand. Yes, they have an actual stand, I think. Oh, there the you are. And Wait. the uh, knockoff American dinosaur still. Wait, so their mascot is knockoff Batman? Hey. And they're like, the, <laughs> and they're like, 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 they I don't remember whatever happened to it. I don't know.
Hello, sir. Hi, I'd like to place an order. <laughs> Looks like you've got the routine down. Maybe they'll hire you full time. Hopefully not. Looks like you're doing all right. The limited time combo with Ooh, chili that is rude. fries and a coffee. Oh, and um, <laughs> one smile, that please. Put Jokes aside, sugar in your there's coffee. actually something I wanted to talk to you about. Hey, manager says to take your break. Wait, what? Mochizuki's here? I see you chose this place too. Well, my internship ended a little early, so. So what? You came here to rub it in my face? You better not start picking up, up chicks in here. You are oh, literally sir, a chick man. You know that? Here. A sworn enemy. Oh, now that you're here, I'd actually like to get your opinion too, Tomochika-kun. About what? Lay it on me. We got time. They said I should take my break now too. Come on, this is our chance to chill. I don't even think about wiping tables. <laughs> you two get along pretty well, huh? I guess I'll go order something. You guys go ahead and find a seat. Hold on, the manager hooked me up with some nuggets. Let me go grab them. Not such a bad person once you get to know each other. Just kind of intimidating at first. I think this should be enough for the three of us. Nice, you know your junk food. Now, this is what being a high schooler is all about. So, you wanted to talk about something? <sighs> well, it's about Junpei Kun. Yori? Are you guys doing the same internship? Yeah, we were supposed to, but he didn't show up. Until today, that is. I finally saw him, so we talked for a bit. Did something happen to him? I guess I should have, but I don't know. I couldn't bring myself to do it. It felt like he was suppressing an unbearable sadness. Like he was forcing himself to act normal. You know, Mochizuki, you're really starting to get on my nerves. Huh? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Why? You're that good looking, but you still watch out for your bros? You're too perfect. What are we even supposed to do about this guy? Anyway, I don't know what's up, but I guess even Iori's not immune to getting bummed out sometimes. Guess that shouldn't be surprising. No one ever said being a teenager was easy. Let's give him some space, yeah? He's got this guy living in the same dorm. That's a recipe for recovery for sure. So don't worry. I'm sure Iori will bounce back in no time. Yeah. Well, nothing more to do but take him to karaoke sometime. I'll let him know you were worried about him. Thanks, Tomochika kun. Oh crap, the time. Yeah, I gotta get back to work. I didn't even get to eat any of this. It's up to you now, Mochizuki. <laughs> I don't think I can eat this much. Uh, guess I'll go ask for a to-go box at the register. He's probably right. I'm sure Junpei kun will be back to his cheerful self again soon. Especially with you around. You're his best friend, right? Yeah, I'll do whatever I can to help. I have to admit, I'm a little jealous. I never really had someone like that before. <laughs> Perfect squad, go! <laughs> but what about now? Oh, uh, sorry. Don't mind me. Seeing Junbei kun like that had me worried about you as well. But I guess you're doing just fine. It's just... I don't like it. Seeing you, seeing my friends in pain. Sorry, I didn't mean to drag this on so long. See you later. Good luck on the rest of your shift.
Investing them in a better weapon. Welcome. Yes. Which one? What would you like? I'm one garnet short. Go on, look around. After turning my hobby into a career, I still find myself buried in research. Guess I can't kick the habit. How many? Did that catch your... We have a deal. I'm sure this will prove to be useful. How many? We have a deal. Is that all you need? Come again. Average level 68. My level. <laughs> no. I haven't used her more than twice. I think I've done that one. Okay. I can check tomorrow. Okay. Or today. It, today is tomorrow now, so. Good morning. This is oh. Elizabeth. Speaking of which. Update or people. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered oh, into Tartarus. Two this time, I believe. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and rescue. Goodbye now. I'm good. Hey. Thanks. <sighs> yes, I'm here. Oh, sorry. Don't scare me like that. So, there's something I want to ask you. Okay. Uh, spend so much time with me it's gotten you into a whole mess of trouble and honestly some of the stuff i've said is really not okay is it because we're both persona users or nope. are we actually good friends or Close. do you by any chance have feelings for ding 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 I win an ultimate persona. What do you really think of me? What? Go away. 
Are you serious? You're not pulling my leg, are you? You really mean it? Wow. Uh. <laughs> Sorry. It just feels like a weight's been lifted off my shoulders. The tears won't stop coming. <laughs> You're so hard to read. You're always so kind to everyone. That's why I thought you saw me as just a friend like everyone else. Lately, I found myself getting upset when I've seen you talking with Fuka. It made me scared that I was turning into a petty, jealous person. I felt awful about it. So, um... I'd like it if you had eyes for me. And only me. Okay. One more round job, buddy. Unfortunately. Just be glad you can only ro romance the people of your opposite gender. I would have had every single person in this game. <laughs> no, it's really not Jinpei. Yes. Everyone. Really Even the dog. <laughs> Just everybody. Just to see what would happen. I mean, don't take it to free being a bro a little bit too far, buddy. Well, it's called bromance, right? Oh, God. It always ends up funny whenever you try and go with way too many people in these games, so. Yeah, I want everyone. Even <sighs> Igor. So what do you want? <laughs> <laughs> I want. Oh. I want to romance Igor. <laughs> Jidori's sketchbook? They found it while they were sorting through her belongings. Ah. Um. <laughs> I know I gotta snap out of this, but it's just so hard. Yeah. Hey, Junpei, can I take a look? Probably wouldn't understand her drawings anyway. What the? Wow, it's really good. This is amazing. Who wouldn't understand a drawing like this? Huh? What? It's... It's a detailed portrait of Junpei-san. For all the times I snapped at you, I still hate to admit it, but just know I'll be counting on you. Oh, Bobby was annoyed with it. Bobby was still using HP. Wow, so it's a life steal. That could be useful. Kind of. It's skip two. It was at seven, now I'm at nine.
Marvelous. I'm looking. Are you accepting a request? Oh, just... Tenth a hundred shrine visit. Mm. Yeah. That one doesn't sound fun. Very well then. Actually, yeah, let's have a look. I need a better gun for I guess. Yeah, I need another garnet for the good one. But maybe he kills a decent one. Got everything look good. Take your time. Angel shot. Everything look good here. Alright then. Uh, don't sit down. It's just a basic real gun. It's better to hold off and get the, uh, effect ones, even if they're not as good. That what you want? Alright then. Should be pretty good for now. Hmm? You finished? Come back soon. Three. Wow, felt weird. That thing felt good. Three days to go. I'm going Good, good. She's a being. Bad kid. Infrared goggles. They're all powerful, but they scream when you walk. Thanks, kid. Luxury fruit basket. I'm guessing a durian. These take a week to deliver. So if I buy fruit, I would get mush. Bye bye. Most likely. I don't think even if I bought that, it'd be safe to eat. No. What's up? Yep. Ah. For the star. Glad we can meet up one more okay. time before I take off. I believe that's Lucifer. Always sharp as attack. Yep. I'm leaving right after this. Factory's way out west, so I'm moving into a dorm there. I've already sent my luggage. Now I just gotta send myself. My mom started crying and blaming herself. I I'm the one who wants to do this. This is a new chapter in my life. <laughs> Guess I should say goodbye to this ramen too. Well then, I better get going. Let's head to the station. Hey. Here, take this. What? I want you to hang on to that. Oh, from your dad? Well, it's a car key, obviously, but it's not just any car key. It's the key to my dad's car. 
I've been keeping it for good luck. Sometimes I get pretty pissed that he's not around anymore. My life wouldn't have been so complicated, you know? I could have enjoyed track more. I wouldn't have had all that pressure to be the best. But by blaming him like that, I was just running away from my problems. That's why I want you to have it. I don't want to risk running away again. But if I know you have it, I'll be able to stand on my own two feet. Then next time we meet, I can still be proud of who I am. <sighs> Thank you. And don't worry, Thou art I will romance the, the car. Thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the Star Arcana hath been set free. Did you ever hear about that we weird TV guy? There was a running joke online years ago about how he within literally. Within a car? No, I thought you meant the really stupid, dumb program that actually existed over in America and once in the UK, where you get a car, normally an SUV or a Jeep at that time, you park, put it in a shopping mall, and you invite everybody to come over and put exactly one hand on the car. The catch is, if you take your hand off the car at all, your eyes, last person standing with their hand in the car wins the car. Mm -hmm. The thing is, you're not allowed to move at all. Mm -hmm. Like, at all. You know, you're not allowed a 10 minute break every hour either. So if you need to go pee, or go pee, or go get a drink or anything, you're screwed. And yeah, there's some people that lasted over 100 hours, by the way. No, <laughs> genuinely, there's people with like nearly 110 hours with one hand on the vehicle. But yeah, there was a guy, he had an interview years ago about him sticking his ding dong inside of oh, a well, car's well, exhaust well, and well, having sex with it. Yeah, I've heard of that. You know, I thought they put your hand in the car, we'll but I thought that was a mess or a joke. No, it turns out it was a genuine real thing. By the way. Again, starting in America. What's funny is I'm pretty sure one of the people that actually won the vehicle in the American one was a uh, environmentalist. Why would you enter that if you... They didn't realize it, they just saw a whole load of people standing around in a mall with their hands on the car and decided, oh, I'll join in. And yeah, they ended up like winning it. That's stupid. Yeah. By the way. Time. I'll piss them off. Oh, all of your save files are gone. Enjoy! Hmm. In that case... I didn't put a lot of thought into what books I brought. I just took whatever caught my attention. I apologize. I should have asked what your preferences were beforehand. If you don't mind my asking now, what kinds of books do you usually read? You know, how to run your own mafia. For me personally, I would definitely do more novels. Oh, do you now? I'm partial to historical fiction myself. I actually read a lot of it. I'm rather fond of novels. All you have to do is turn the page to experience another person's life. And that reminds me, Yamagishi mentioned liking novels as well. I never inquired further, but maybe she'd make for a good reading partner. Incidentally, the books I brought today are things like biographies and history books. I can attest that they're all worthwhile reads, rather accessible ones too. I hope you find them to your liking. Oh my, you're really tearing through the pages. I'm impressed by your focus. 
it's a very confusing thing to wrap your head around. Yeah. If you did that, your head would be like a rope. Yeah, and those are quite really worth it, the ones I mentioned. You know. It's nice to spend some time reading quietly together like this. Thank you. That made for a relaxing evening. Well Want then, it's about time we return to our rooms. Good night. I'll go to sleep once I borrow some tea. I will stash some off. So, in this section. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. I believe it's the cherry blossom. Yeah. Well, the answer was pretty Cherry for all. I think it would be a mash and cut. Did I mash the cut? Nope. Hey there. No, we've got the right now. Yeah. And then tonight I will. Try and get hello. Oh, welcome back. You're late. Ryoji kun was just leaving. Oh, hey there. Chilly out, huh? Hope you don't go catching a cold. You know, I stop by here pretty often. Weird we never see each other. Well, I'm out of here. See you later. Later, Ryoji. Was that Ryoji san? Yeah, he said he was going home. Why was he here? Ryoji he going right? home. They've been hanging out a lot ever since the school trip. But the rules state that visitors aren't allowed here. Yeah, but Grijo Senpai said it's cool as long as no one stays late. I don't think we have anything to worry about. He is dangerous. Dangerous? Ryoji-kun? Come to think of it, he did hit on Mitsuru-senpai the first time he met her. But having him around has really helped cheer you up, Junpei-kun. Well, no point in dwelling on the past, right? Won't change a damn thing. That's true. Hmm? What's up, ai -chan? I'm fine. It's just... I envy you, Junpei. I'm a machine, so I don't understand what it feels like to live. Really? But you don't seem that different. In my case, it's more accurate to say that I'm operational as opposed to alive. There are times when I malfunction, but I can always be repaired. Well, if we were all like you, then we never have to worry about dying. Oh, crap! Uh, I don't have time to talk right now. I've got a mountain of homework. Serves me right for slacking. Oh, no use whining. Junpei studying on purpose? I guess hell finally froze over. Well, better call it a night then. The gift of life is not something I should possess. A weapon is much more difficult to operate when it's alive. That said, I believe I understand the concept of loss. Leader, the thought of something happening to you, it makes me... 
Understood. You are very special to me. I can't explain why, but I never want to leave your side. I want to protect you at all costs, to be there for you always. Uh, I apologize for keeping you. You must be tired. So much has happened in so little time. I'll return to my room as well. Good night. Yoji Mochizuki. He is dangerous. What is this unsettling feeling? I am a machine. I can't die. So no one will have to grieve for me. I have to do something. I don't want to see them suffer anymore. to the Velvet Room. Regis is overriding acceptable. I've completed registration. Now then, let Well then, shall we take a look? Are you satisfied with this? Please choose what skills to inherit. Level 88? Mm -hmm. Holy crap. you need not yet so. it is a special persona you desire Michael. is it not oh, perfectly Lucifer. Oh, yeah, Lucifer. Nope. Oh. I have the panel and Doable, but I need to set up some precautions for that. The would have to have this set up now because that would be a very last ditch effort one. Because it could kill my enemies, but if it doesn't, they will yeah. kill me. Yeah, you will. I should go there right now. I'm gonna go. I have the option to just ignore it completely. Huh. 
part room, laboratory. Thanks for coming. Well... How do I put this? I suddenly just got this feeling that I'm running out of time, and... I felt like I had to see you. I had to talk to you. <sighs> Sorry. I'm not even sure what I wanted to say to you. So... I guess for today, I'd like to say thanks. It hasn't been that long since we met, but I feel like I've learned so much by spending time with you. I just really wanted to thank you for that. You showed me around the school and the city. I got to hang out with you and the others. I even got to go on a trip with you. That was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. It's been a joy to experience and learn new things every day. Just like this. <laughs> That's an interesting suggestion. I'm sure it'd be wonderful if we could play together. But maybe we'll save that for another time. When I saw those couples in Kyoto, or when I visited you guys at the dorm, I realized that's what it really means to build a connection with someone. It's that feeling of overcoming something together and keeping each other going. Both sides need to come to an understanding. That's how connections are built. Right? I want you to know that you're important to me. I know I said I wanted us to be friends, but... Oh? I actually want to be something more. What about you? I don't really get it myself, but I... Excuse me. Oh, it's you. Sorry, I hope I didn't interrupt. I was just passing through the hall, and I heard someone playing a beautiful song on the piano. So I thought I'd stop by to watch the performance. Who was the one playing? Was it you? Oh, I wanted to ask. It might have just been my imagination, but I thought I sensed Ryoji-kun's mm. presence in this room. Were you not with him? Hmm? Enjoy your spyware! Have a look at oh. so dance. If you want to go ahead, you do whatever. Let's do money, my biz, to mind your own biz, whatever like is. We go through with the set. Hey, 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 you look at fire with the burning desire every day. We're inspired, but never yeah. inspired. Uh-huh. 
Mm -hmm. Hello. Yes, this looks good. Just to be safe, we should adjust the amount of fertilizer and make sure they get enough sun. They look like they're growing fine now. <sighs> what a relief. Oh, I only lent a helping hand. I'm sure tending them is important, but it's all thanks to the plants themselves for being so strong. You know, after I treated the plants when they were sick, I kept coming back here to check on them. I noticed that the spots where we had cut off the leaves were already sprouting new ones, and in just a little while, they were healthy and green all over again. Maybe I'm making a big deal of this, but it made me realize that life is actually quite amazing. It didn't matter that they had been weakened, or had damaged parts. Just giving them a little support was enough for them to show how strong they really are. Yes, it really gave me hope. I think in a lot of ways, we're just like them. I'm not sure how to say it, but I hope I can be as resilient as these plants are. check on the plants one more time just to show my appreciation maybe if I keep thanking them they'll grow even healthier all right that should do it shall we head back down sure good morning hello Oh, you ignore that one. I want. Well, it's been four days since then, but I want to get a point where it unlocks a new region of targets before I go back. Ah, because I can't be bothered to keep going back up and down. Yeah, you know what, Val, I don't feel like you're losing the point. Now I just have the ability to go. I did. Yes. Yeah. I'm curious. room really is too small to practice in <sighs> but come to think of it I guess I don't have to practice in secret anymore although 
I don't live on the first floor here, so I might be disturbing the people downstairs. Hmm. I chose a long weapon so I could match the reach of an adult. But then I learned that long weapons are actually better suited for tall people. Ah! Oh, I hit my shin again. Jeez, I hope I get taller soon. Oh yeah, where'd my milk go? <sighs> Maybe I should be drinking more milk. Hmm. It hurts my stomach sometimes, though. <sighs> I'm gonna leave this one here. Hope you have fun.